Yeah. Oh, that one. Look at that. Handcuffs look tight. They do. Do they hurt? Mm -hmm. No. Montgomery Cliff. Yeah. After a near Seinfeld-esque sentence, Larry was back on a plane headed home from Atlanta with the ones he chooses to spend his life with, for better or worse, for the final scene of Curb Your Enthusiasm. Now, even as the airing of the final episode approached, Larry maintained his stance that he was void of emotion about it. Is there any shred of sentimentality that comes with that for you? Maybe a shred, the slightest shred. I don't really get sentimental. Yeah? Yeah, I'm not sentimental about it. Now, I always take note of the final scene, of the final line, of the final shot of a famous show, like seeing how they decide to wrap it up. And ending it on a shot of all seven of those characters in the frame all talking at once demonstrated to me how fond Larry was of those actors and those characters. The actors and the cast, they kill me. I couldn't imagine ever having more fun in my life than I did doing that show. And on top of making the narrative decision to end that show in that communal way. All right, here we go. And action. In a very rare occurrence, the final scene on screen was the final scene shot as well. I need the light. Which of course means that the seven actors and crew were all together for the final wrap. In the behind the scenes footage, there's these two quick shots of Larry that are probably as poignant as you're ever gonna get from Larry David, likely because he thought no one was looking at him. But yeah, I see a man very reflective in those moments. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That's a wrap on the funniest show ever! <laughs> While Larry appears to quickly want to exit the communal rap scenario that he set up, Richard Lewis makes him stop. Larry David has treated me like, like a god, and all of you have, and this is the greatest experience of my career, and I love each and every one of you. I'm honored to be working with arguably the greatest sitcom writer in the last two centuries, and God bless all of you, and thanks for being so sweet to me. Now, after the finale was shot, Richard passed away from a heart attack in February, and on Sunday today, I mean, talking about being sentimental, Larry says that he keeps Richard around. Actually, I, I talk to him because I feel he's, he's watching me and I tell him to, you know, hey, leave me alone, you know, keep away, you know, you got stuff to do. I loved him. Um, it's a, yeah, big loss. I was just thinking about, um... Now, not only is Larry trying to exit stage right, but Cheryl Hines also has something to say. Ted Danson seems to be shuffling off camera as well. He's probably like, I've done these final scene rap things so many times. Ugh, with Cheers, and Becker, and Damages, and CSI in The Good Place. Ugh. I was thinking about you because my entire life changed when I met you. And our crew, oh my God, you guys, thank you for everything. Grace. Larry, I love you. <laughs> And after the finale aired, Cheryl posted a montage of images from the past 12 seasons on Instagram with the caption, I love you all. Jeff Garland commented on the Curb's post of the behind the scenes footage, writing, Watching this is very emotional. I really am touched by your emotional reactions to our show and us. The end of an era, thank you. Now, while Larry continued to shuffle off set, he did have to come back for some final photos. Larry, the crew wanted to give you something, and it's hard to figure out what to get you. So, what we finally decided was, you know, what do you get the person who has everything? Something he's gonna hate. So, bring it up, boys. <laughs> the gift was a big painting of Larry. It was signed by everyone in the cast and crew, which is great, but I'm thinking the fact that those signatures are surrounding a big portrait of him, means this is not going to be prominently displayed in Larry's home. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Thank you, everyone. <laughs> if, if you could somehow remove me from this, it would have been much better. Yeah, what did you think of the Curb finale? 